Hello friends, so today we can discuss this question from the latest Court Forces Round 636 Division 3 Problem A Candles. So in this question you are given that recently Vova founded N candy wrappers and he remembered that he bought X candies during the first day, 2X candies during the second day, 4X candy at the third day and so on, till these candies at the K at day. But he doesn't remember X or K. So X is the this number factor. And K is for how many days he bought the candies. But he know that how many total wrappers are there. So if we add all the wrappers x plus 2 x plus 4 x, the total wrappers is equal to n. So he know that number. So you are given t independent cases and you have to find out what is the value of so you have to print out x, this factor. Okay. So these are the questions. So let's see this with one example. So if you have x on the first day, 2x on the second day, 4x on the third day and so on. So what you can do is you can take x out and the series will become like this 2 plus 4. So it's a gp. And a sum of, if you do a sum of this gp, it is r to the power of n minus 1 where r is the difference the uh, the power difference the power difference is 2 so it's actually equal to x into 2 to the power because we do for k days to the power k minus 1 and that is equal to n so we have to find out x and we do not know k or x, we just know n. Okay. So what we can do is, if we increase the value of k from 1 to let's assume 10 to the power 4, that can be possible. This increases at a very fast pace at an exponential phase. So we can get this value and we know this value, so we can easily get this x value. So that's our pretty simple logic. What we'll, we're gonna do? So we loop over the value of k, and we we will do till we found x. Okay. So let's quote this question. So what we can do is we first take t test case input. Y t minus minus. And what we can do is we first take the input of n. And then for and uh, it is also given that k is greater than or equal to one. So k is so we start k from two. K is less than or equal to. Let's take it a very large number. One eight i plus plus k k plus plus. Then we store the power in two to the power of k. And we have to subtract 1 from it because it is we have to divide n by 2 to the power k minus 1. So this is 2 to the power k minus 1. And if n perfectly divides this p, so we know that this is our answer. So we see out n divided by p. We give it a line break and we break out of this that's our code let's try to run it For this, this is the output and it's matching. Let's submit it.
I hope you understand the logic. If you still have any doubts, please mention it in the comment box. I'll try to identify it as soon as possible. Thank you for watching this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.